Our deepest point of the river is in New Orleans. It's 190 foot deep. So we have a lot of water even though we're in a drought here. The challenge that once you cross over and you get started getting above uh, Baton Rouge, you only have as much depth of the river as what you create through dredging and, and management. And so as the water falls, you start to lose that distance between the top of the water and the, um, and the riverbed. Our challenge is we don't have enough force in the river and that allows salt water to move from the Gulf of Mexico upriver. When unimpeded, it can move as far as uh, New Orleans and Baton Rouge. The challenge that we have here, as well as everywhere else in the country is the answer is rain, and we don't see rain in the, in the Mississippi Valley. And so we're gonna to continue to face these challenges. We're gonna to have to continue to be proactive and work with our locals and our state uh, governments. But until we get rain, we're gonna be faced with these kind of situations. When it slows down and you can't push, have as much throughput, you can't push as much through that river system, then ultimately it's going to affect the end produ the, the, the initial producer, which is the farmer, right? So they, they can't get as much down as fast and it costs more because the industry, the barge industry, is needing to use more vessels, more mariners to pay for this restricted draft. Ultimately, you're restricted by what the river will do or not do. If, if there's no rain between now and the end of the fall, there's not going to be an answer at some point because at some point there's going to be no water. Jelajahi cara baru mendapatkan informasi. Download Metro TV Extend sekarang.